So this is just a quick little video on how to get this off. As you can see, I've replaced the gear stick gator with a nice red one compared to my old one, which is a bit naff. Now matches the steering wheel, but I didn't know how to get these off and I just sort of guessed and I actually thought I broke it, but you basically just have to pull this bit, the knob actually twists onto that bit there, but you have to pull it off first and then normally it will separate. So I've just been sticking it back into gear like that and pulling. And what will happen is you'll pull too hard and it will suddenly ping off. That. 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 I've just hit my elbow. But that'll happen. Which is fine. I can get that back on. And then as you can see there, it just comes off the top. Like that. So that just twists in to that. Like that. Let's see if I can show you. Now. I don't know if you can see that. That goes in like that, and it just twists on, so that stays on, and then you put it on that. You'll notice that little plastic thing there with that groove inside. If you take the gator off, which I've just had it off, you'll notice down below there's a groove, a corresponding groove, so you know that it goes down like that. So when I, all I'll do is I'll put that back through the gator, and then I'll just push it down. Right, okay, so I've managed to get that back in. I didn't show you that because it's a pain in the arse and I've done it four times. And I don't want to show you again. But it is possible. It's easier if you do this beforehand. But now I know that's on the right way. I know it's on that shaft with the groove corresponding. And I should just be able to push it straight down. There you go, you hear that knock. And it's now solid again. It's clipped back in. So when you twist the knob so to speak back onto the plastic reverse gear okay, so that's now clicked down but when you put the knob you twist that onto the reverse bit the knob then actually clicks into the gear lever itself so once you clipped that onto that you push that down and you'll feel it clicking again and now it's solid so when I take it off again I'll probably bang the elbow like I did earlier but I seem to have full range first second third fourth fifth sixth and reverse over there that's lovely jobs are good and so the only final bit I've got to do is put the provided cable tie around that bit there I'll keep it in place um, and what I actually did for this gator was I actually glued it on rather than stapling it. I've got where is it? Here it is. I've got this stuff, no nonsense super glue. It's awesome stuff. It dries in 30 seconds, keeps everything. I'm hoping that'll do, especially as it's jammed in that gap anyway. So I'll let you know. But it was easier and I think better than stapling it. Half the old staples I took out had rusted anyway. Um, so that's that. So that's how you get the old gear knob off if you want to replace it. Now I know how to do that, I might replace that at some point, although I'm happy with it for now.